Rufus abused the harvester to steal tiles from the town hall hey. roof. Hey, hello. Hmm? Rufus they can snap you on this. Good pick. Rufus has stolen the that. screws off the children's uh, merry-go-round. Rufus has stolen the antenna of Miss Ingle's tractor. Rufus breeds grasshopper in the wheat silo. Rufus abused the harvester to steal tiles from the town hall roof. Rufus is a no good nick. Rufus I don't has stolen the, the screws off the children's merry-go-round. I don't Rufus believe has stolen the antenna of it... Miss Ingle's tractor. Oh, oh, I can't even look at it. Wheat silo. Rufus abused the harvester to steal tiles from the town hall roof. Rufus hey, is a no good you who? Hello. Hmm? Uh, make it snap, Rufus yes. has stolen the screws off the children's merry-go-round. Rufus has stolen what the was that about the pigeons? Miss Ingle's you mean tractor? the fact that they take their bearings from Rufus the planet's magnetic field? Is wheat that not silo? fascinating? You're right. That is Rufus to say, it is not fascinating. The town roof. I'll be going to do that. Is no good I... Kick. If this is where the key to the world belongs, good night. I mean, I meant it. Luckily, I'm a gifted lock picker. What? Not even with this? What kind of a lock pick is this? the planet's magnetic field. Oh, it could have been my idea. A gadget that manipulates the planet's magnetic field. Oh, this could have been my idea.
I'll leave it like this for now. Maybe this helps. Rufus is no good Nick. Rawr. Rufus has stolen the screws off the children's merry-go-round. I'll leave it like maybe this. Rufus has stolen the antenna. Back to normal speed. I've got these gift vouchers from Tony's shop. Gift vouchers that one supply you. Where, where, where? Address that what? Dispatch. Postage being scanned. Error postage pay packages padding pa one medium pigeon from Rat Rufus breeds grasshoppers in the wheat silo <laughs> I like how it's all relaxed now. Ah, Rufus abused the harvester to steal tiles from the town hall roof.
I'll leave it like this for now. Maybe this helps. Rufus and a good... I've got these gift vouchers from Tony's shop. Gift vouchers verified. One light lead weight from storeroom one. Supply your address now. Wh address dispatch. Postage being scanned. Error. Postage pay. Packages. Padding. Pop. 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 One heavy. See you later. Ah, bubble wrap. Who doesn't like that? Pop. Pop. Ha ha ha. Pop. Pop, 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 pop. Oh, 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 yeah. Error, error. Uh. Is something wrong? Shall I leave you alone? Pop, 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 pop. Oh, 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 yeah. Uh, whatever you say. Oh, well. Now he's finally blown his last fuse, which was to be expected.
What? Why am I talking so quickly? Because the translators are paid by the word. I'd rather not disturb him. He looks so happy. I'd rather not disturb him. He looks so happy. Someone has pierced some holes into the sheet and put numbers on them. Oof, the mailbox must have been really boring. Someone has pierced some holes into the sheet and put numbers on them. Oof, the mail. Rufus in the house, and soon he'll be in the vault. Now he's in the hall. Here he's hurting the foot. Ouch! Oh, ah, yeah! What's this? Neither mic nor headphones. Oh, must I do everything myself? All that's missing is the headphones. All that's missing is the headphones. If I nudge it, it starts nodding. I want that feature for Tony. What I'm planning with it really is worth a headline, but <laughs> I don't want to let the cat out of the bag. It can't do anything but nod. Hey, that's a perfect replacement for Wenzel. Next, please! 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 Rufus is out of the antenna, I have missing goose. Next, Rector. please! Rufus breeds grasshoppers in the wind, Hey, Max, you who is? Hello? Rufus abused the harvest hmm? to Oh, it's you again. The they Rufus? can snap you, I'm busy. Rufus, isn't that good thing? Please! How's work? All hell broke loose here all of a sudden. Now the second line is going to be blocked. Now if someone else gets the idea of going into the incentive mode, I'll go crazy. That's for sure. Next, please. I'll be going then. You do that. You shouldn't be behind. Please. Next, please. One for now, and one for the road. Hey, stop it! Don't play with the divining rod! Shoo! Ow! Ow! They're clinging to me with their claws. Obviously, they don't want to go back in there.
Next, please. Next, please. Next, please. Next, please. Next, please. I don't want to let the cat out of the Next, bag yet. Please. Next, please. Next, please. Next, please. I bet makes more sense than anything Logan. Next, please. please. The operator will thank me. Next, please. Next. Next, please. Next, please. Next. Rufus, is it no good, Nick? Next, please. <laughs> Rufus has stolen the screws of the children's merry-go-round. <laughs> Next, His nerves please. Are worn please. To I know I have missed Eagle's track. <laughs> His nerves Next, are worn please. Please. Rufus please. breeds grasshoppers in the wheat silo. Next, please. Rufus abused the harvester to steal tiles from the town hall roof. Please, Rufus, is it no good, Nick? Next, Next please. Rufus has stolen the screws of the children's merry-go-round. Next, merry -go -round. please. Rufus has stolen the... This needs an adapter. Small jack to uh, big jackass. <laughs> Ready to go. Hello? Is anyone there? Hello? Uh, Cletus? Chunk slide hazard in the northern quadrant caused by a flock of stampeding... Cletus! Come on! Your love is the most wonderful gift. Cletus? Cletus! <sighs> Rufus is the most wonderful gift. They call him Rufus. Rufus! <laughs> Searching for my fiancé, calling all inhabitants of Deponia. Hey, wait a second. Name is Cletus. I am searching for my fiancé. Possibly, she is... Cletus? Cletus! Is that you? This is Rufus! Can you hear me? Hello? Rufus? Are you on Deponia? Of course I'm on Deponia. And where are you? On the Organon Cruiser? Or Elysium? That's none of your business. Well, I need a few answers from you before we talk about your fiancé. Answers? Depends on what you want to know. Are you really from Elysium? Of course I am, but I don't get why you should care where I come from. What's it like on Elysium? Well, it's not as dirty and uncivilized as down here, and the people are less annoying, too. Brilliant! Sounds like the perfect place for me. And you two are really engaged? Why are you asking me that? Uh, nothing. Forget it. Oh, just, uh, <laughs> chewing the fat. Does your fiancé have a sister by any chance? What are you talking about? Oh, it's just a, <laughs> just a thought. You should spend less time thinking. Seems like your head isn't up to the task. What was your fiancé doing on board an Organon cruiser? That's none of your business. But isn't it a bit strange that a woman from Elysium was... Don't worry about things that go far over your head. Let's get down to business. Are the Organons planning something? Why do you want to know that? Listen, never get involved in matters of the higher spheres. You'll never understand what's happening up there above your head, let alone influence any of that. Don't even bother to try. Has your fiancé always been a bit odd? What? What are you talking about? Uh, nothing. Forget it. Uh, nothing. Forget it. Uh, okay. Let's assume for a second that your fiancé is suffering from a kind of, um, concussion. A concussion? Yeah, but a purely hypothetical assumption. <laughs> then you shouldn't waste time and get her to me. You'll be very sorry if you've hurt her. I need her brain to be fully functional. You really love her, don't you? No further questions.
Very good. Maybe we can go back to the matter at hand. Yes, that's what I thought, too. First, I need some answers. Answers? Depends on what you... No, for... Very good. Maybe we can go... Yes, that's... You still haven't told me everything. I guess I have my reasons, but if you insist. No further qu- Very good. Maybe we can go- Yes, that- I'm not doing this for myself. I'm doing it for gold. What do you think I am, a fool? If you're trying to squeeze more money out of me, you better just say so. Well? What do you want? I want you to take me with you to Elysium. <laughs> Impossible! Well, that's my price. Either I can come along to Elysium, or... Listen, I can't take you to Elysium. There must be something else you need. Nope. I want a passage to Elysium or nothing at all. Well, then you'll get nothing at all. Well, if that's what you want, you can go ahead and cancel your wedding. Wait a minute. Maybe there's a way. I knew it. Bring gold to me. We'll meet at the Lower Ascension Station at the shore of the Rust Red Sea tomorrow night. I'll be waiting on top of the platform. Do you think you can make it there? Tomorrow night? Well, I don't know. If, uh... I thought you wanted to get to Elysium. Or didn't you find goal after all? Well, I, I did. I did. Well, then we have a deal. I'll meet you after sunset. Cletus, over and out. Just, w w wait a second. I... Cletus? Okay, Upper Ascension Station. Down on the... Uh, up on the Lower Ascension Station. Up on top of the platform. Ha! Huh, easy as pie for a guy like me. Elysium, I'm coming! But where is Goal? What the? Hey, what are you doing? Gizmo! Look at you! Finally, I brought you to justice. What is that supposed to mean? It's me, Rufus. I know. And believe me, it was not easy to solve this case. The case of your missing IQ? No, I'm talking about a series of crimes that have been committed this very morning. Ever since that girl appeared, our community has been in turmoil, arson, sabotage, disrespectful behavior toward the authorities. You don't have any proof of any of that, you stupid idiot. Theft. I'm innocent. Yeah, okay, let me rephrase that. If I am guilty of any crime at all, then that crime is love. Everything I did, I did for goal. Where is she, by the way? Has she gained full consciousness yet? No, but she needed more room. She's with Mr. Wenzel. What? That treacherous toad? That's unfair. I found the Elysian. Me! It was me! Who found the Elysian? Uh... Wenzel found the Elysian. It was Wenzel, none other than him. Excuse me, but who are you? My name is Argus, Bailiff Argus, Organon Prime Administration. 
Ooh, the prime authority in my office. And I forgot to brush my teeth. How can I be of help, Bailiff? I heard you have an Elysian woman in custody. These are community matters. Is that so? Interesting. What if an Organon search party was to reduce your community to rubble? Would that be community matters as well? Don't let him threaten you, Gizmo. The girl is with Mr. Wenzel. Gizmo, no! You'll find his house below the water tank, right next to the town gate. Thank you, Inspector. You just saved your community a lot of suffering. Yeah, really. Well done. Shut up. As long as he's in police mode, I'm not going to be able to get out of here. Luckily, there's arson all the time in this jerkwater town. Hey, hello there. <sighs> what is it now? Let me out! Let you out? Huh? Why in the world would I do that? I have to save gold from the Organon. Didn't you do enough damage for one day? You heard the man, didn't you? I'm innocent! Well, not in my eyes. All clues we found point to you, Rufus. The conditions in this cell are unacceptable. Are they really? So, you think you deserve better? I do. I neither belong in this cell, nor on this junkyard of a planet. Right. You think you belong to Elysium. I know I do. Why do you think they'd let someone like you into Elysium? A thief? A good-for-nothing drifter? A troublemaker? When I get a chance, I seize it. I determine my own fate. <laughs> The only thing I see you seizing is other people's property, which then gets destroyed or incinerated in the process. Well, you can't paint a house without spilling some paint. And if it's highly flammable paint, then in the end, everything goes up in flames. I mean, that's life. Time is running out. Already? Well then, brace yourself. I can tell you it's the third week in here that drives people insane. What? How long do I have to stay in here? Well, at least until the court case. But considering the list of your crimes... That's impossible. I have to save gold. Well, you should have thought about that before you disrespected the law. Well, that wasn't disrespect. It was more like a, a spoonful of neglect. My doctor says my attention deficit syndrome might strike any time. Uh, where was I? I need to pee. Please try to keep it in. I cleaned the floor just the other day. I promise to better myself. The irredeemable Rufus. Don't make me laugh. You're right. I'm pretty much perfect already. I give up. Good. For now. You're nothing but a traitor, henchman of the Dark Exchequer. Keep quiet. I'm not a big supporter of the Organon. I only have the safety of our community in mind. Fire! Nice try, boy. But my fire detectors would tell me if there was a fire. Medical emergency! It can't be that serious if you're still making a fuss like that. And now be quiet, you phony malingerer. I'm hungry! Food will be served after sundown. Nat's piss and cactus bread. You'll have to wait till then. Nothing! So why don't you just be quiet? Hey! Hello there! <sighs> what is it? Let me out! Let you out? Huh? Why in the world would I do that? I give up. Good. For... Nothing! So why don't you... No great in the world can hold me back. There. Why you... Never! My inventory could burn. And Tony is not going to mend it again. Boy, how often did people around me carry that thing screaming like babies? But there's no water here. Shit. No surprise, it hasn't rained for me. The divining rod doesn't hurt, obviously. Not necessary. Goal has her cup. 
have to stick this. Not necessary. Goal has her coffee black. That's it. I'll just set fire to the tree. Gizmo will go into firefighting mode and I can escape using the pole. Uh, if only I could reach the tree from here. That's it. Uh, Gizmo will go into firefighting mode and I can escape using the pole. Uh, if only I could reach the tree from here. Never! My in Antonio. Never! Antonio. No great in the... There! While you were... It's the last tree left. I hope it doesn't croak. I mean, where would I test my herbicide? That's it. I'll just set fire to the tree. Uh, if only I could reach the tree from here. Boy, how often did people around me carry... Never! My Antonio... Hey, I don't have... And an exchange. Hey, stop it! Don't play with the divine shoe! Hey, stop it! The shoe! Nope. Knowing Gizmo, I suppose... Gizmo never understood my philosophy regarding the redistribution of wealth. Although it's fairly easy. From everyone else to me. What? What was that sound? How about emergency? Fire control mode activated. Firefighter Gizmo at your service. What happened? Where's the fire? Oh, Mr. Firefighter, my poor kitty climbed up the tree and she's afraid to come down. Don't worry, madam. I'm a professional. Come, kitty, kitty, kitty. <laughs> Genius prevails. <laughs> Wenzel! Rufus! What... What are you doing here? What am I doing here? Ha! You know very well what I'm doing here. Where is she? Rufus, please, let me explain. No, you spineless traitor. It's not what you think. We'll see about that. Tony? You? What are you doing here? Me? I don't know. Finally, at a loss for words, I don't believe it. But I don't care what you think, there is an easy explanation for all this. What? No! no I, I don't even want to know. I, I don't even remember asking. Keep your gross secrets to yourselves. I just want to know where Goal is. Who's Goal? Oh, so your little lover boy here didn't tell you about his other conquest. Conquest? Wenzel, what is he talking about? And why are you dressed like that? Well, um... I thought, uh, uh, oh, and who the heck is Goal? No one, really. I mean, she's not even working properly. What the? Where is she, Wenzel? I put her in the basement. In the basement? Well, I see that you two have a lot to talk about. Have fun.
<laughs> Go! Would you too small? Just too small. Yeah, I know. Don't worry. I I'll get you out of here. Open up! Organ on! But you're already inside. No excuses. The strong suspicion arose that you are harboring a member of the Resistance on the run. Rufus, what kind of mess is he in now? So, you admit your crime. He hasn't been harboring anyone. He just burst in. Go ahead. He's down in the cellar. Uh-oh. I have to think fast. I have to barricade it. It is written, our hero was smitten And rescued the maiden from impending doom On a horse made of steel, evil guys on his heels He rode with a girl into dawn's early gloom She awoke by his kiss, well at least more or less And the whole part concerning the uppercut scare Can be pinned at least to some extent On her damaged brain and plan Anyway, in a big picture, who's gonna care? Who's up? 